what is good we're back with the mad no sex browns franchise taking on the atlanta falcons in atlanta today so michael vick's return to atlanta should be some interesting stuff so alex smith is still at quarterback for the falcons they still got cadillac williams in the backfield they got drew bennett and plaxico as their top two receivers tony stewart in this guy at tight end i think his name's garrett hartley like the kicker that actually used to play for the saints in real life interesting they have a decent offensive line. They still got Jonathan Ogden, even though he's old as crap. Brad Meester's getting up there, too. I don't know any of those guys. Jason Babin is playing outside linebacker for them. Antonio Pierce is their middle linebacker. Joey Porter at outside linebacker on the other side. Fabian Washington, who we traded over there, as you know. There's his stats since we traded him over. Moving on. Here are their safeties. Jeff Reed is their kicker. Interesting stuff here. Our impact players against their impact players. As you see, we have a pretty beastly secondary. And we get the ball first to start the game. Stretch play to Clinton Porters. He's going to go right side. Runs a man over. He's still going, but the safety is going to come down and make the play. Second and five, Michael Vick looking to throw. Finds Antonio Gates on the corner route. That's a first down for Cleveland. First down, 10 coming up. Slant flat concept. Randy Moss gets him on the release. He did an outside release on a slant, which I don't think is the best idea, but hey, he took it deep, which is smart. So that's why I threw it to him, because he took the slant deep kind of like in between a slant and a post. That's why I threw it to him. Antonio Gates making that nice catch in traffic on the dig. He followed with the quarterback when Vic rolled. Vic rolling to his left once again. Tries to come back to Portis. That's knocked away. Second down and 10. Vic looking to throw. Fires at left side. Finds Jones on the curl route. That's going to be a first down. The truck stick did not work. He got chopped down. Now misdirection play, Portis is going to get it right side. He trucks a man and keeps going. Makes something out of what was almost nothing. Second and seven now looking left side, Vic. Looking for Ben Watson in the back of the end zone. That's caught. Touchdown, Browns. That's what I'm talking about right there. First down now for the Falcons. They get the ball. Alex Smith's going to roll right. He's not getting away from Derek Burgess. That's a sack. Second down and 15. Stretch play to Carnell Cadillac Williams. He's going to get a solid game before he's brought down. Third down and four. Play action. Alex Smith looking. Does a 180. That's picked off by Sean Taylor. There we go. We got the ball back. First down, Cleveland with beautiful starting field position. Vic rolling to his left. Looking. Wide open is Ben Watson. And he threads the needle. Michael Vick finds the hole in the defense. First down, stretch play to Portis. He follows his blocking guard. He outran him a little bit. He should have been a little more patient, but it is what it is. Second and goal, Portis spins up field. He's not going to get it. Third down and goal. Toss play to Portis. Can he get the edge? Yes, he can. Touchdown, Cleveland. There we go. And we're going to make it 14-0. First down now, Cadillac Williams gets the toss. Our defense is there. We pursue like a pack of wolves. That is what I'm talking about. Second down, Alex Smith taking a shot down the right side of the field. That's caught by Drew Bennett. That's just a height advantage. You got Lito Shepard, who's like 5'10", and Drew Bennett, I believe he's 6'5". You'll have to look it up, but I'm pretty sure he's listed as 6'5". Second down, after that play, Cardinal Williams, he's going nowhere. We're on that. That looks like Mays getting there, making the play. Third down, looking. Kelvin Hayden can't make the play. Tony Stewart catches it, turns upfield. That's a first down. And Lito Shepard's hurt. Great. First down, Cadillac Williams. He's going to go up the gut. He's going to run to Sean Taylor, who makes the tackle, but he still gets a solid gain. Second and two, fullback dive. We try to go for the hit stick. We whiff, and the fullback it keeps going, and that's a first down for him. Now they give it to Cornell Williams again. Spins off of Sean Merriman and keeps going. And he's brought down by Asante Samuel. Play action. Alex Smith looking wide open is the fullback in the flat. He stiff arms Sean Merriman. Sean Merriman's getting bodied, man. What the heck is this? First down, Cardinal Williams in the end zone. Touchdown, Atlanta. They just destroyed us on that drive. We got to get it right offense. Michael Vick rolling to his right, fires it. Brought in by Vincent Jackson. First down for Cleveland. Vick looking to throw again. Moving in the pocket. Looking unless that finds Clinton Portis. Clinton Portis turns up field. Rolls a man over. He's still going. First down, Cleveland. Now we hand it off to Ronnie Brown, and he's going to be brought down. They brought a corner blitz. Second down now, Mike Vick looking to throw. They send a blitz off the left side. He finds Jones on the drag route. We get a decent game. Third down now, hitch corner concept. Vick looking, steps up in the pocket. He's going to take off first down. Nothing wrong with that. We'll take it. And we're going to go no huddle right into it. Oh, it's a dig corner concept. Excuse me. I thought it was a hitch corner concept. I apologize. And it's wide open again. Michael Vick rolling to his left. He's going to take off again. Doing what he does best. Doing what made him the man in Atlanta back in the day. 
first down now. Clinton Portis gets a stretch play. He's going to bounce to that side. The 10, the 5 touchdown, Clinton Portis. That was a beautifully developed play and beautiful blocking by our pooling linemen. Got to give the O-line credit. They don't get enough credit for what they do in the trenches. Mad respect for them. Second down, play action. Alex Smith looking, take a shot down the right side of the field. Good defense right there. We're on that. Drew Bennett, you're not mossing anymore, my DBs. Third down, though, Alex Smith takes off. He's got a first down. Okay, we'll give you that. Vince Wolfork on the tackle. Newsom, though, he's going to sack Alex Smith. That's a big loss for the Falcons. Second and 18, they bring the tight end in motion. Smith looking right side. Now goes back left. That's caught by uh, Dixon, I think is his last name. Third down, Smith looking right side. Taking a shot down the right side of the field. We're on that, and that's incomplete. Fourth down, and they have to punt. First down now, Portis. He's going to bounce it outside. Gets up field. He's going to be brought down with the hip thrust of the free safety. <laughs> Ronnie Brown catches the ball on the flat row. He uh, bodies somebody with a stiff arm. Timeout Atlanta because he got bodied. Mr. Figgins, he got bodied, and he's got a uh, broke foot or whatever. He's limping off the field. First down, Mike Vick rolling to his right. Vincent Jackson wide open. Vick gets it away just in time as he gets crushed by two Falcons defenders. He sets his feet just in time. First down now, Vick looking to throw. Fires it across the middle again. Gates brings it in on the cross that time. That's what I'm talking about. Now we got the halfback angle play. Portis. He's wide open, and we are going to go to him, but Michael Vick's under pressure. They sent a blitz and got back there. Second down, long Portis. He's not going to get much on that play. Third down, 20. Vick looking to throw. Gets it quick to Gates. Gates brings it in in traffic, absorbs the hit, holds onto the ball. So we're going to kick the field goal after the Falcons call a timeout. We're going to go ahead 24-7. to So Atlanta gets the ball back before the end of the half. Caleb Williams stuffed in the backfield. And, yeah, that was a wrap on their half. And then White's going to get the kickoff return. And Antonio Gates with the shoestring tackle to slow him down. First down now, Williams. We whip on a hit stick again, and Cadillac Williams inside the 50. Ed Reed brings him down. If Ed Reed didn't bring him down, that might have been a touchdown. First down, Cadillac Williams. He's going to be brought down. Ed Reed coming up to make the play. Second down and nine. Alex Smith looking to throw, looking right side. Takes a shot down the middle of the field, though, and that's going to be knocked away. What's his name? I think that's Dixon. Tried to go high point it. It didn't work. Third down, they go short to Drew Bennett, and that's going to bring up fourth down. That's out of field goal range, so we get the ball back. Play action now. Michael Vick rolling to his right, sets his feet, fires it, and that's knocked away. Good defense right there. I thought we had Jones on that crosser. Second down, Portis gets stuck. Third down, play action. Michael Vick looking to throw. They double Randy Moss. Vick's in trouble. He's got to get out of there, and he's going to get sacked before he can get out of there. So we have to punt the ball. And White gets it on the punt, and we're going to bring him down. And then there's an injury on the play to Mr. Branch. A backup the end handoff is Carnell Williams he's gonna lower his shoulder get a few second down and six Alex Smith looking right side tries to roll to his right hit as he's trying to let that go and complete third down and six draw play to Carnell Williams and we're gonna bring him down short brings up fourth down they're gonna try a 55 yard field goal can they get it and yes they can good kick by Jeff Reed so first down for us after that find Clinton Porters out of the backfield that's always an easy check down pass and this guy's banged up, Gibson, with his afro and all that. First down after that. Greg Jones is wide open, but why not when you take a shot deep to Randy Moss and Fabian Washington's fast enough to run with him pretty much. So he's not tall enough, but he's fast enough to sort of keep up with him, you know, 98 speed, and he gets his hand in there. Should have gone to Greg Jones in hindsight right there. We go to Gates. Third down, Vic looking. Gates actually came open. I'm actually surprised I made that read, but oh, why not? Vincent Jackson's wide open. I guess I was hoping for Jackson to cross, but I, I mean, now I'm looking. I saw Gates wide open on that play, too. Like I said in one of the earlier videos, you see the reads you make, and you read it completely different months later when you're watching it. Like, why did I go there? What am I reading there? Interesting. And right there, there's a face mask half the distance to the goal. First down and 10. Vic rolling to his left. He's rolling. Now they're attacking him. He goes to Vincent Jackson. Is that a touch? Oh, they said he's out of bounds. I want to challenge that because I don't know. Those feet were pretty close. So let's see. Here we go. We got the instant replay. Look at Jeff Fisher. He's looking. Oh, that's a college catch. That would work in the NCAA. Look at that because, see, his left foot's in the air when he makes the catch, and he didn't just put his left foot down. Uh, that's bad body control by Vincent Jackson. Oh, well, it is what it is. So, yeah, we're going to lose a challenge in timeout right there. All good, though. Second and 10. Hand it off to Ronnie Brown. He gets through the hole, and he's going to get a few yards. Third down and goal, or third and 10, or whatever. Third and six from the six. It's pretty much like third and goal. And Michael Vick gets an easy rushing touchdown. Once the solemn roll to the left, you already know that's a wrap. Like, that big old defensive lineman's going to catch him. Michael Vick's 
like 40 right now, and he still probably would have gotten into the end zone if he ran that in 2021. And somebody just got a beautiful. That's Sean Merriman. Sean Merriman, we need to get your strength up in the offseason because you are getting bodied. Man, we need to get you in the weight room. This is terrible. Second down, Alex Smith. He's going to do a QB draw, and that's a first down. Now they're going to run a draw play to Cadillac Williams. And Sean Taylor has to come up and make the play. Second and seventh, play action. Alex Smith looking, steps up, goes across the middle. That's tipped and knocked away. And they're going to call pass interference on DeMarcus Ware. It's a terrible call. That is a horrible call. And it's a spot of the foul call in the NFL. That's what I hate. They need to go make it like 15 yards. Right there, Sean Taylor with the user pick. Holler at your boy. And Alex Smith, he's going to take him out of bounds with that tackle. And yeah, I don't know what that coach is doing. He's probably yelling, saying, yeah, you got to make better reads. Coach him up, coach. Right here looking for Jones. He's going to get that one, though, coming across. And he loses the ball. And Bowen's going to pick it up. And Bowen loses his helmet, exposing his shiny bald head. Yeah, I had to get him right there. Sorry. But yeah, we had to knock his helmet off, expose that shiny bald head. So let's see. I don't know, because that's pretty close. It looked like the ball came up when he went to the ground and like his knee kicked it up or something like that. Because he has it there. And you can see this guy jump. And they're starting to go down. And he's down right there. And then the ball, he kicks it up. It, but I don't know. Was the ball coming out while he hit the ground? We're going to see. Who the heck is the Falcons coach? Is that Marvin Lewis? I don't know. I'll have to go look it up. I can't remember. That looked like Marvin Lewis. You know, these coaching guys, they, I don't know, they all look different. With these visors and hats, they all have different things on in these uh, Madden games. They did a good job with the coaching graphics, actually, surprisingly, at this age. Right there, though, we go to Jones because they reverse the call. It's not a fumble, and we get him in the end zone touchdown. He's a pretty big body receiver, too. That's why we traded up to get him out of Penn State, you know. A little bias in that, you know, even though he's a fictional player. But you get what you get what I mean. You get it. So, first down for Atlanta right there. Hand off is the Cadillac Williams. He's going to bounce it outside. Sean Taylor says, no, sir, though. You're going to be sat down right there. Second down. Smith looking. Three receivers. Tries to go back to the left. That's picked off by Marcus Trufant. There we go. And our defense really came to play. Play action now. Greg Jones is wide open. We get it to him late. It gets through. Greg Jones turns up the sideline. He's inside the 25. First down for the Browns. Now we hand the counter play off to Ronnie Brown. He's going to make a move. Bulls a man over. That's a tough run. First down for Cleveland. And we, I think we got a field goal. And this guy, White, gets a kickoff return. But it's coming back because Fabian Washington, our former player, was holding. So, yeah, he ran all that way. And... It gets called back. Sorry for you, buddy. So let's see how the Falcons are going to do with 47 seconds left, down by 31. Alex Smith looking left side. That's caught by Plaxico and taken out of bounds. Second down, three coming up. Alex Smith gets the ball, drops back, looking to throw. Locked on to some defenders. Takes a shot down the left side of the field. And that's knocked away. Third and three. Alex Smith drops back, looking left side. Finds Dixon. And Dixon breaks the tackle. And Dixon is taking that to the crib. Touchdown, Atlanta. And 41-17, they're going to go onside kick. Can they get it back? No, they can't. Nice job, Vincent Jackson. That's game. We're going to beat the Falcons 41-17. Get up out of here. See, I'm going to show the stats. We look pretty good as an offense. We're kind of gelling. You know, it's the second year under Jeff Fisher's system. I like it. I like where we're at. He says it's been a minute since I played with all these teams, so I probably will be knocking off some rust. But hopefully I'll make some solid reads and we'll be all right. You feel me? Hopefully it's some muscle memory, you know what I mean? So I guess we'll see what happens uh, when we play with them next. So yeah, in the meantime, I'm going to uh, end this. Stop yapping and let these stats show. And yeah, I still got, I think, some more games coming. I don't know. I, I told you all I have extra videos because, you know, I played all these games before I left thinking I would have time to work on them at uh, school. I didn't. I was pretty busy. So now that I'm home, uh, I have some time because I'm not just studying all day for finals. They're pretty straightforward at this point. So I study a little bit and then try to make these videos and whatnot. So, yeah, talk to you all later. Deuces.